Ladies and gentlemen, this is the live coverage of SAF Under-16 Championship 2023. This is the second match of the day, Nepal versus Bangladesh. We just heard the national anthem from the two countries and we are about to kick off with the game. And we have the referee today, the official referee is Hussain Zari Zahir. First assistant referee is Raleev Raif. And second assistant referee is Sunwar Hem Kumar. And the fourth, fourth official is Benjuru Gen. And the first 11 for Team Nepal. Let's introduce the players. We have from Team Nepal number 16, Bimba Norbu Boti. Number 7, Subash Bam. Number 8, number 8, Ekraj. Vishwakarma, number four, Arvind Kumar Dami, and number eight, Sujal Shantan, number nine, Ram Tavi, number ten, Santosh Bumba, number twelve, Hamish Maji, number fourteen, Prashant Mokdan, number fifteen, Nishan Raj Lawa, and finally number twenty-three. Jersey and 
Team Bangladesh with a green and white jersey. Nepal with an early long kick. The pass and the defense from Bangladesh has kicking it out of bounds. And it's going to be a throw in for Team Nepal. Number 15 with a throw in. Header won by Team Bangladesh defense. And once again, it's going to be a throw in for Team Nepal. Long throw in. Once again, the header won by Team Bangladesh. And this is going to be the first corner for Team Nepal. Ladies and gentlemen, Team Nepal is a team to be looked out for besides Team India. They were the runner up in 2022. Team India had defeated Nepal to win the 2022 SAF Under 16 Championship. And there goes the corner kick. First header won by the defense from Team Bangladesh, and once again, another, it's going to be another corner kick. The second corner kick of the match in the very first two minutes. This is going to be an exciting match. Both teams are equally weighted, although a slight advantage is uh, taken by Team Nepal. There's a whistle, there's a foul in the play, and this is going to be a free kick for Team Bangladesh. Goalkeeper, Nahidul Islam. Team Bangladesh, a wild pass there. Maybe the nerves are playing into their, into the game. Throw in for Team Nepal. Situation possession gained by Team Bangladesh. And that ball goes out and it's going to be thrown in for Team Bangladesh. Good team pressing. A very quick start for both of the teams here. Throw in by number three, Siam Omit. It's an area ball situation and that goes out and it's going to be a goal kick for Team Nepal. <coughs> Goalkeeper Pemba Norbu Bote. Quickly passing it off. The pressure has been put on by Team Bangladesh. They gain the ball possession. The cross. He fakes. He's got plenty of time. He weaves in. Wow, that was very, very close. Team Bangladesh putting on the pressure very early in the game. Here we see in the replay. He gets away from the defender. Get in contact with that ball pass. Bangladesh once again intercepting the ball. Nepal now with the ball possession. A through pass. He's making a run for it. Can he keep it in play? He cannot. That's going to be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. A long throw in. Header won by Team Nepal. But the ball possession is maintained by Bangladesh. Intercepted by the defense from Team Nepal. Bangladesh still has the ball possession. And that's been struck a little bit too hard. Too much speed on that. It's going to be a goal kick for Team Nepal. Pemba Norbubote, the goalkeeper, quickly passes off. A long pass to the midfielder. Team Bangladesh enjoying the majority of the possession. That's a good pass. But struck a little bit too hard. The goalkeeper is right there easily. Cool and confident is the goalkeeper Pemba Norbubote from Team Nepal. Nepal now in the attack. That's good defense from Team Bangladesh, and they also have the throw in. Team Nepal, a good turnaround by number 12. And a hopeful attempt from about 40 yards away. A 
hopeful attempt to say the least, but at least an attempt nonetheless. And that ball is going to go strolling out. Throw in for Team Nepal. Finds his man. There was a deflection there. A good through pass. Very close calls on both ends. Nepal on the attack. Bangladesh playing it cool. Good defense there. Good pass. Finds number 11. Number 11 on the run. Can he do anything about it? The defender was right there. Good tackle. And that's going to be the second corner of the match. In the first corner for Team Bangladesh. He quickly passes it. Deflect it. He's going to cut in. Blocked. But the ball is still with Bangladesh. And a very long attempt once again, but nearly closely. It's going to go home and he had an opportunity, but could not close the deal. Team Bangladesh really threatening in the very first six minutes. He had a great opportunity, but he fumbled in the end. Could not create any angles. He was straight towards the goalkeeper. But what a great attempt by number three. It was a long attempt, but it, it curved down and it could have gone in, but it hit the post. Goalkeeper had a touch to it, and he was right there to save that really easily. That could have been a first goal for Bangladesh, but they could not convert. Bangladesh really putting the pressure on. The defense from Team Nepal is quite of quite flabbergasted, fumbling a bit. There's another good pass by Team Bangladesh, but that was offside. A lot of threat is going to come from the left flank for the Bangladeshi. <coughs> Taking the free kick is the defense from Nepal, number two. Bangladesh right there. A hopeful long pass, but he did. Is he going to find his man? And that's going to be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. Team Bangladesh really pressuring from the left flank. He's going to lead that for number three, Siam Omit, for the throw in. A wing back. Good clearance there from the defense. A slip there. The game still goes on. Imran Khan, the pass was a little bit too strong there, it goes out of bounds. It's going to be a throw-in for Team Nepal. Team Bangladesh really putting the pressure on. In fact, that was a foul there. It's going to be a free kick for Team Nepal. by Team Nepal. Possession still maintained by Team Bangladesh. He's making a run for it. Good defense there by Team Nepal. Not taking any chances. Yet, the threat is not over. Team Bangladesh. Keep 
keeps the ball alive. Good pass there. Can make a turnaround. And there's a foul there. And the foul is awarded too. The foul is given to Team Bangladesh. It's going to be a free kick for Team Nepal. It's quite fortunate there for Team Nepal because this could have been a very precarious situation. To the team captain, number 10. Uda Faisal with a long pass, he finds his man on the right flank with the attempt. He just could not find that proper curve there. Just couldn't bend it right enough, but a very good attempt nonetheless. <coughs> he created just enough space there. He got the strike going, but just couldn't get enough bend on that. Bangladesh once again winning the ball possession. This is a very fast paced game at the moment. Oh, a terrible error there. He was trying to keep that in play, but he goes out of bounds and it's going to be a throw in for Team Nepal. A very advantage, advantage position for Team Nepal. Cross and that is out. Could I get that proper bend there? Oh, another error there from the defense of Bangladesh. Nepal now has a chance. Good. That might be upside, but the referee has kept it. And that's a goal! But the referee. Is that an offside? No, it's not an offside. Yes, it is. It is an offside. The referee has called it an offside. Ooh. Very, very fortunate for Team Bangladesh. But the defense knew they kept their defensive line. Here we see in the replay, <coughs> 23. He loses the first man. A good pass there, but number 10, the team, the number 10 was already offside before the ball was passed. Here's another angle. Resuming back to the game. And that ball is kept alive. Still in play. A lot of pressure from back up from Team Nepal. And there's a foul in that play. It's going to be a free kick for Team Bangladesh. Number 23 from Nepal. Dylan Limbu. Really fast. Someone to keep an eye out for. Ball situation. Good defending there. He's checked his man. He clears it. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're tuning in right now, please do subscribe to our channel, Sportsworks. And there's a cross. Getting closer and closer is Team Bangladesh. Really making that play from the right flank. Team Nepal, number 12. Oh, winning the ball is Team Bangladesh. Now on the counter attack. But there is a whistle on that play. Ooh. It's going to be free kick for Team Nepal. Team Nepal. So far, both teams are equally matched. A slight advantage to Bangladesh as they have more offensive attempts. But you cannot count out Team Nepal. Oh, there might have been a handball. There's a bit of a protest there. But the referee has not called. There's some protest going on there, but nothing comes of it. 
It's going to be a goal kick for Team Bangladesh. <coughs> Hopefully, if we can get a replay of that last attempt, maybe, perhaps. But here we go. That's the corner. And that is clearly a handball. Clearly a handball. I'm surprised the referee did not give a penalty there. Clearly a handball. Unfortunately, the South Asian, I'm sorry, the staff, under 16 championship 2023 matches, we do not have the uh, VR, VAR checkup. So whatever the referee says, it stands. And we can clearly see from that replay that it was a clear handball. And as the game goes, that is the beauty of football, I guess. The, the referee stands, he has the authority, and the game must go on. It's going to be a throw-in for Team Bangladesh. Throw in for Team Nepal. It's a good, it's a good try, Team Nepal. It's coming forward. The cross is blocked, and this is going to be another corner. So far, the corners have been quite promising for Team Nepal, and this is another advantageous situation here for Team Nepal. Can they convert from this particular corner? And the corner is struck well right in the D area. The header is won by Team Nepal, but it goes. Keeping the ball in play is Team Nepal. Bangladeshi defense is fumbling a bit. Team Nepal. It's a bit of a heavy touch there. And now the team captain from Bangladesh is making a run for it. Passing it off to the winger. Can he beat this man? Yes, he does. And the cross is shallow. Oh, what a mistake. Oh, and the attempt is a bit too hard. He opened his body, but he could not bend that down. He could not keep that down. Bangladeshi's attempts coming closer and closer. You see there in the replay, clearly disappointed. He knew. He knew when he struck that ball that it was not going to be in the target. Once again here, Team Bangladesh. Slowing it down now, passing it back. Switching it over to the right flank. Bit of a heavy pass, but they maintain ball possession. Once again from the right flank, he's making a run for it, number nine. That ball is going to be a throw-in for Team Bangladesh. Really attacking from the right flank is Team Bangladesh. It's a long throw-in. Oh, and Sorry? it's headed out of bounds. And it's going to be a corner for Team Bangladesh. So a glimpse of the head coach from Team Nepal, Mr. Chaifu Raman Moni. For a kick for Team Bangladesh. A bit of a hassle tassel there in the D area. The referee has to step in. Give a little stern warning there for the defense from Team Nepal. And hustling there. Oh, the kick is good. A bit of a fumble. And that ball goes out. It's going to be a goal kick for Team Nepal. The linesman raised his flag. <coughs> Bimba Nobu Boti, the goalkeeper from Team Nepal. 
exciting match so far. Both teams equally matched so far. Both teams had really good opportunities. Defense from Team Bangladesh not taking any chance, but they do have the ball possession. This is a good through pass. Can he get the man? Well defended there by Team Nepal. Today, lots of mosquito. This is going to be a long throw in for Team Bangladesh. Once again, loose ball, Team Nepal, snatching that ball, number seven, back to him, but the pass was in, quite inaccurate, Team Bangladesh now, both teams making quite silly errors with passing, but overall, both teams passing really well. There's the team captain from Team Bangladesh, number 10. Midfielder. Cross, bit deflected there, blocked. And number 14 there. And team of ball. The game goes on, advantage was given. But that goal goes out of bounds, and this is the throw into Team Bangladesh. Last touch by Team Nepal. Possession gained by Team Nepal. Really great pass there. This is an opportunity. The goalkeeper is there. Cool, calm. Number 10, the team captain from Bangladesh. Really creating plays there, someone to look out for. Here's the uh, replay. Oh, the tackle was a 
bit uh, high footed. Referee, clearly, clearly that was the right call from the referee, although the audience seems to not like the call from the referee. As we can see there in the replay, it was clearly a foul and the uh, slight tackle was very high footed. Head coach from Team Nepal, not happy with that call. Team Nepal. Turns around, beats his man, the cross is there. Oh, and the goalkeeper misses it. It's an area ball situation. Nepal with the ball. And the defense is right there to clear it. A hot thumping moment for Team Bangladesh. That could have been an opportunity for Team Nepal. Both teams so far had some really good opportunities. Mr. Cross, that could have been a very huge error there from Team Bangladesh. Defender right there, just clearing that ball. Team Nepal slowly, but surely, keeping in. That's a good ball there. A header is there. The goalkeeper is there to save it. Could have been the first goal for Team Nepal in this match. Very fast thinking from the goalkeeper. He was a bit forward. Corner quickly taken past. He cuts in, gives it off. He tapped. And once again, the goalkeeper. An easy save there. Good save. Success before. Greatest of plays, but he's overwhelmed by the defenders. And the ball is awarded. The free throw or the free kick is awarded to Team Nepal. To the full protest of the uh, striker from, from the winger from Team Bangladesh. Number 20, Mong Singh Marma. Bangladesh. A bit of a chaos there. Nepal seems to be doing well, especially in a chaos situation. The cross is there and the defender is there to block it. Throw in for Team Nepal. Team Nepal really slowly creeping in. Seems that they've got their footing in this match. And the cross. Side. So it's going to be a free kick for Team Bangladesh. Yes, it is an offside. It's going to be a free kick for Team Bangladesh. Goalkeeper Nahidul Islam. Exciting 30th minute into the match. Another whistle on that play. This is going to be a free kick for Team Nepal. There's a foul on that play. Aerial ball situation for both teams. Loose ball. Team Nepal. He beats his man, he attempts, and what a save by the goalkeeper! 
He got a hand on that. This is going to be a corner for Team Nepal, but what a great attempt. And an equally great save by the goalkeeper. As we see here in the replay, he gets some space from the defender, and he just curves it right in there, but the goalkeeper gets his hands on it. Beautiful save there. Corner kick, Team Nepal. Struck really well, right in the D area. Header won by Team Bangladesh. And another great attempt by number nine. Round Tabi. It's going to be a throw in for Team Nepal. Team Nepal really coming together now. Here's the cross. Nothing comes of it. Team captain from Bangladesh, number 10. Long pass, good pass there. Here's an opportunity. The referee points towards the goal. It's going to be a goal kick. Ooh, that was a, a close call there. Team Bangladesh, but there is a whistle on that play, and it's going to be a free kick for Team Nepal. Are they going to quickly take it? Number 14 to take the free kick. Once again, trying to attack from the left flank. The defense is right there. That might have been an error. He saves himself, takes that out. Throw in for Team Nepal. Team Nepal really attacking from that left flank. Maintains ball possession. Beats three men in the process. Oh, a feeble attempt there. A feeble attempt. No power. No power there. Ball winning possession, but he kicks it out. This is going to be throw in for Team Bangladesh. Team Bangladesh is significantly slowed down at this 33rd minute of the match. Team Nepal really picking it up, picking up the pace, and they're, they're, they're doing really well. They're playing really well, attacking really strongly from the left flank. But here comes Team Bangladesh. Another throw in for Team Bangladesh. He quickly throws it. It's a long throw in. Once again, the defender is right there. We see the head coach there in the blue. Sporting suit wear with the yellow beef jersey. That's the head coach of Team Nepal, Ramen Moni. Number three, Omit from Team Bangladesh. With the throw in. It's going to be a long throw, a false start there. Taking his time. Once again, the different moves there. Trying to clear the ball. There was a deflection there. Goalkeeper is right there. Good defending there from Team Nepal. Quickly rolls the ball. Now attacking. That's Team Nepal. A good pass there. Struck a little bit too, too hard there. Goalkeeper right there to receive the ball gently in his hands. There's another error. Team Nepal, this is an advantage. Mm, he did make a run for it. Too much 
of speed on that. Once again, intercepting is Team Nepal. The long pass, header by Bangladesh. Miss header there. Possession with Team Bangladesh. Team captain here now. Can he create and cut a play here? Yes, he does. And the defender is right there. Good defending. Team captain from Team Bangladesh. Number 10, Huda Faisal. Someone to keep an eye out. He does create plays, an unusual plays. He's fast. A good pass. Team Nepal. The defender is running. Oh, what a good defending there. He came all the way from the back and got that contact on the ball. Good defending there by Team Bangladesh. As we see there, oh, what a good, good, good defender. This is what a defender does. Throw in for Team Nepal, number 15. Rajlawat. Long throw in. Loose ball. Bangladesh with the ball possession. Now on the counter attack, team captain. Can he make a run for it? Oh, he's overwhelmed. Stolen by Team Nepal. This is a counter attack from Team Nepal. Once again, overwhelmed by the defenders. Cleared by the defense from Team Bangladesh. A lot of midfield action happening for both of the team here. Whoever wins the ball possession in the midfield seems to be likely getting the attempt situation. And here comes Team Bangladesh. Attacking from the right flank. Seems to be their favorite. Makes a turn around. Creates some space. Passes it off to the team captain. Big crosses, beats the man, and that's going to be a corner. Last touch by Team Nepal. Another corner for Team Bangladesh. Yes, he does. Beats his man. But the touch was a little bit too strong. Bangladesh is still maintaining ball possession. Nepal defending well, but there is a foul on that play. And it's going to be a free kick for Team Bangladesh. And we have two players down on the field. One from Nepal, one from Bangladesh. Bangladesh player down is the team captain. Seems to be all right. He's slowly standing up. I think he's all right. He's walking it off. But we have a player down from Team Nepal. The head coach from Team Nepal clearly frustrated there, having a word with the linesman. And the linesman does not hear, want to hear anything of it. As we see there in the replay, he's been stepped on apparently, but all in fair play. And that was clearly unnecessary from one of, from the defense from Team Nepal. It's going to be a free kick for Team Bangladesh. It's very difficult to see from that replay, but he might have got his foot stomped in the process. He seems to be all right. <laughs> taken out of the pitch. I'm sure he'll be returning back to the game. The referee's having a word with the head coach. Very stern warning there, and the head coach is not liking it. The next time he does this, I'm sure he's gonna get a yellow card. The head coach from Team Nepal, really upset with that call. He had his, one of his players equally injured. 
but the foul was clearly committed on the Bangladeshi, so hence they have the free kick. Free kick taken by Omix, number three. A long cross, good angle there. Ball goes off. Out of bounds, and it's going to be a free throw for Team Nepal. Quite, quite an exciting match so far. Really fast paced game here. Oh, an error by Nepal. Sweeping it up is Team Bangladesh. Oh, with a bicycle kick, he clears it. He didn't want to take any chance. What an acrobatic move. Didn't want to take any chance, and that was probably a really good move there. Showing some appreciation was from the Team Bangladeshi side. Oh, I thought he was going to try another bicycle kick there. Oh, he finds his man. If you're tuning in right now, you're watching the live match between Nepal and Bangladesh. Please subscribe to our channel, Sports, Sports Works. Throw in for Team Bangladesh. Last touch by Team Bangladesh, so it's going to be a throw in for Team Nepal. A good area. Quickly throws it in. Hit the first touch. The cross is in! Goalkeeper is there to touch it off! Oh, but he cannot get full contact there. Another chance! But nowhere near the target. Some really interesting, interesting situations for an attacking movement. Another bicycle kick. This is becoming very popular now with the defense from Team Nepal. Unfortunately, that is a big error there. Team Bangladesh. The cross is blocked. It's going to be another corner. Team Bangladesh. Taking the corner kick is the team captain from Team Bangladesh. Huda Faisal. Really good player. Creating the matches, creating the play for Team Bangladesh. Struck well, right in the D area. Long with a header. Good save, fumbling, and that might be a goal. That is a goal. The referee awards it a goal. And this is going to be goal number one. No, I'm... it is not a goal. It is not a goal. The referee did not award a goal there. Oh, we have to see a replay of that. It might have gone behind the line, but there was a lot of fumbling happening. Could not see a lot of players covering the ball. Not really sure what had happened, but the referee did not award that goal. It's going to be a throw-in for Team Bangladesh. Still on the attack. And that goes out, so it's going to be a throw-in for Team Nepal. Ooh, I would love to see the replay of that. As soon as we get some... Here is the replay. There's the header. And there's the initial save. And right there. Oh no, it is not. Oh, cannot say. Cannot say for sure. It might have been a goal. It might have gone behind. Not really sure. Here's Team Bangladesh once again. Oh, that is a very close call. At one moment, it looked like it was behind the line. But there is a... A lot of nerves being played over here. Here's another angle of the replay. First, the initial save. There's a touch there. And then the second touch might have gone in. I'm not really too sure. 
Here's the header, initial save. Hit, save, and then when he pulls it back in. Oh, that is his glove. It is not a goal. It is not a goal. Wow. Good call by the referee. And here's the cross from Team Balides. The captain, he turns around, attacks, blocks, and clears it. But the danger is still imminent. Another block. Now Nepal on the counter attack. Passes to number 23. A good cross. He gets brought down, but he finds his man in the pass. And there is a call. A foul on that play. But they did have the advantage. I'm surprised. I'm surprised the referee. I'm quite surprised with the referee. I'm not sure who the foul was awarded to. Oh, the foul is to free kick is awarded to Team Nepal, but they had the advantage. The referee should have given the advantage. Very interesting calls in this match. You guys can be your own judges. Nonetheless, Nepal has a free kick, and this is a very good position. They just need to create the right angle. Taking the free kick is number 14. Wow, that was not called for. A total waste of a free kick for Team Nepal there. And, ladies and gentlemen, that is... That is the end of the first half. What an exciting match. The score still stands nil-nil. But what an exciting match. Both teams are equally matched. It started off really well for Team Bangladesh, but Team Nepal slowly picked up. Don't go anywhere because we're going to be starting with the second half. Do subscribe to our channel, SportsWorks, and we'll be right back.
Under 16 Championship 2023 match between Nepal and Bangladesh. What an exciting first half we had. Both teams equally matched. Both had really good opportunities. Well, the second half is right about to start, and the second half will be equally exciting. If you're just tuning in right now, you're watching the live coverage of the SAF Under 16 Championship 2023 right here, live from the Changlitan Football Stadium. Nepal is in the red jersey and Team Bangladesh is in the green and the white jersey. The second half of the match, the team captain of Bangladesh. And here we go. Long pass, and that's been struck out of bounds. It's going to throw in for Team Nepal. Intercepted there by Bangladesh. Bangladesh quickly making the move. Passing it off to the left flank. And that's going to be a corner. That's going to be the first corner of the second half for Team Bangladesh. And the team captain, number 10, is going to be taking the corner kick. kick a header and it's a goal for Team Bangladesh wow right in the very first minute of the second half Team Bangladesh scores from the corner a really good, great header there Bangladesh celebrating as if they won the finals Team Bangladesh Right off to start in the second half, starting with a bang. Number 11. The goal scorer number. We're not quite sure who scored the goal. We will let you know as soon as we find out. Jersey number five was the goal scorer from Team Bangladesh, Ashikur Rahman. We have a player down from Team Bangladesh. Once again, let's take a look from another angle there. Corner kick really struck well. It was intended for the other player, but he was right there. Jersey number five got his header straight on. And here comes another opportunity for Team Bangladesh. Cross, deflected and cleared by Team Nepal. And now Nepal on the attack, and making a run for it. And a bit of a missed pass there, and that's going to go rolling off bounds. And it's going to be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. Had a really great opportunity there. A good, a good counter attack. 
a possibility of a good counter attack. Unfortunately, nothing came of it. There we see the head coach from Team Nepal clearly upset. Header one by Team Bangladesh. Still in the area of ball. Team Bangladesh. Oh, what a great pass! But the defender was right there in the nick of time. That could have been disastrous for Team Nepal. It's going to be a throw in. Number two. Bangladesh. Imran Khan. Overpowered by the defenders from Nepal. And there is a whistle on that play. It's going to be a free kick. going and play like the second half of the first half. He keeps it in play, he keeps it in play. And the cross! He keeps it in play! And the flick and he misses! And it's off target the ball with a great opportunity but he misses off target! Hopefully this is not going to be the story for Nepal. Deflected off the defender and he had a great opportunity. All he had to do was put it in the back of the net. You can clearly see the frustration in the players from the team Nepal. A fortunate break there by for the team Bangladeshis. Team Nepal. Bangladesh with the ball possession stripped off him. From the right flank once again attacking. And that ball is going to go out of bounds and it's going to be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. Unfortunate, unfortunate event for Team Nepal. And if you're tuning in right now, do remember to subscribe to our channel, Sportsworks. Be sure to subscribe to get any future notification and information on the upcoming games. Throw in for Team Nepal. A long throw in. He finds his man. Cannot control the ball, and the defender clears it. It's going to be throw in for Team Nepal. Team Nepal needs to put in that pressure as they have done in the first half. There is a foul in that play. Clearly. Number 12, not really attempting for the ball. He went straight for the defender, tackling him. No attempt to play the ball. Here we see the replay. Deflected. A, a grave error there. That was the foul. The team captain from Bangladesh once again. Team Bangladesh. Mm, two minute red shirts there. Two minute red shirts. 
handle it all by himself. He did have two of his teammates on the other side, but he could not make that turn. Overwhelmed by the defenders. Imran, number two, with a throw in. Touch by Team Nepal. Throw in for Team Bangladesh. It's getting closer and closer to the D area. Header one by Team Nepal. Trying to clear it. But the ball possession once again won back by Team Nepal. And that's going to be a throw in. Last touch by Team Bangladesh. It's going to be a throw in for Team Nepal. on that play. It's going to be a free kick for Team Nepal. A bit of a high boot situation there. Team Bangladesh complaining that the ball is. But we do have a substitute. The first substitute of the match here. From Team Bangladesh, number 20 is out, and number 17 is in. Number 17 from Team Bangladesh is Salah Udin Shahid. Free kick taken by Team Bangladesh, he's gonna go straight for it. Easy, easy for the goalkeeper. You gotta create an angle, you cannot kick straight into the goalkeeper. You have to create an angle for the strikers to work with something. And that's gonna be a throw in for Team Nepal. Last touch, Team Bangladesh. So the last touch is by Team Nepal. It's going to be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. We do have a player down. 56 minutes into the match. Perhaps the lactic acid on the muscles are playing into factor now, getting cramps. So let's uh, take a look at the replay of the goal from another angle here. The team captain taking the corner kick. It struck really well. Right in the D area, the danger zone. As you can see, the first striker misses the header, but number five right there, right behind him. He was quite fortunate. I don't think he even, he even intended. It just landed on his head and he just went right behind. Right into the target, right into the net. Very fortunate. The goal nonetheless. Defender passes number seven. Turns around, loses the ball. Possession now with Team Nepal. Now on the counter attack. The defender's right there. Takes it out so that he gives time for the rest of his teammates to come back around for the defense. It's a 
yellow card. That was unnecessary from Omit. Number three, the defender from Team Bangladesh. Really unnecessary. He was not nearly close. He was straight into his leg. He missed the ball. That can be awarded in another match. That might have been awarded a red card. No intention of playing the ball. He was straight into the legs. Very fortunate thing that he was only awarded a yellow card. However, this is a very good opportune moment for Team Nepal. A free kick positioned in a really good position. Here's another replay of that. That tackle can, could have been very dangerous. I mean, he was trying to attempt for the ball, but he clearly missed it. He went straight into the foot. A, a good opportunity here for Team Nepal. Perhaps the team captains will take the free kick. Number seven, or maybe number three, number nine, perhaps. Ram Tami. Yes, it is. It's going to be the team captain who's going to be taking the free kick. Number seven, Subash Bam. Decided at the moment. Yes, it is the rush. A very good, a very good free kick. A loose ball situation, but the defense from Bangladesh is right there now. They're going to do the counter attack. But not a very accurate pass there. They did have their striker making a run for it. Miss header. Nepal. Stolen. from Bangladesh. Great move there, defeats two men. Bit too strong of a pass there. Good hustle there by Team Bangladesh. From number two. <coughs> could, not, could not maintain ball possession there. It might be a corner. Let's take a look at that. That free kick from Team Nepal. Very good free kick there. Hanging ball. Just needed one of the players to get a good contact there. Unfortunately, they couldn't. And now Team Bangladesh putting the pressure on. And a very, very hopeful, wild attempt there. Nowhere near the target. Won by Team Bangladesh. Team Bangladesh really putting the pressure on now. They do, they do enjoy the advantage of one goal. And that is the head coach of Team Bangladesh. from that side can they repeat the same success once again for an earlier comment where I said the head coach for Team Nepal was 
Raman Moni, that is the head coach for Team Bangladesh. The head coach for Team Nepal is Rabindra Salakar. A good attempt there, just couldn't keep it down from Team Bangladesh. And that is the head coach for Team Bangladesh, Mr. Raman Moni. is team Bangladesh number 11 to number 17 and that's gonna be a goal kick nothing comes of that goal kick for team Nepal Bimba Norbuboti the goalkeeper number 16 
right in the D area. Ball possession maintained, but he could not find his teammate. And now Nepal has the ball possession. Not a really good pass. It's going to be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. Throw in for Team Nepal. Do subscribe to our channel, Sportsworks. Team Bangladesh now with the ball possession, but a missed pass there. And now Nepal. And the defender, there was a very irresponsible, very weak clearance there. He had plenty of his teammates nearby to make some passes. Now Team Bangladesh, he loses his man. The cross. And the defender's right there. Once again, a very poor, poor clearance. And the flag is up. is up for offside it's going to be a free kick for Team Nepal Pushing once again, and he's gonna let that ball run out of bounds. It's gonna be a goal kick for Team Nepal. I don't want by Team Bangladesh. Mm, that would have been a very close call. Team Bangladesh number 11 had a really good game today. Maintaining ball possession is Team Bangladesh. Trying to spread the defense pin. Really passing well. Team Bangladesh overall has probably more percentage of uh, ball possession compared to Nepal. However, it's just a slight, slight majority. Percentage possession. <coughs> A free kick, fourteen the ball. It's a very good place. And the free kick is put in the D area. Any chance the defender number three omit it's gonna be a corner kick for Team Nepal. Can they convert? 72nd minute into the match. Can Nepal convert? Can they score an equalizing goal? A corner for a corner. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel Sportsworks. Here's the corner kick from Team Nepal. Headed off by the defender from Team Bangladesh. It's gonna be a throw in for Team Nepal. Nepal really needs to be careful. 
but at the same time they need to take some risk. They need to take some risk if they are to equalize. If passes like that are not gonna do it. Passes like that are not gonna do it. And the ball goes out of bounds and it's gonna be a throw in for Team Bangladesh. Bangladesh. So far, the last 20 minutes have been purely dominance shown from Team Bangladesh. They've had far more opportunities for attempt. Team Nepal on the run now. He's been taken down. Referee's going for a yellow card. And he's given a yellow card to number eight. <laughs> Team Bangladesh, <laughs> Abdullah, Chesty. Abdullah Chesty is one of the substitutes. Not sure if there was a full contact there. He did make the tackle, but he fell afterwards. I'm not quite sure. Might have been the momentum of that tackle. Long cross there. Could have been dangerous. Nepal needs to create, more, generate more of these kind of opportunities. But they need to convert if they need an equalizing goal. Bangladesh, but cleared by the defender. Fed right back in. Loose ball, but cleared. Clearly more of the headers are won by Team Bangladesh. And that's a foul there. Really high boot. Could have been a yellow card or perhaps even a red card. Is a yellow card. Did <laughs> you see the replay? Fumbling. And that could have been dangerous. That was a high boot. Free kick for Team Nepal. Good turn around there by number seven. He beats the second man. And the third man, the third defender is right there. Now Team Bangladesh. He beats his man. Defender, he goes all the way. Is he gonna go all the way? Oh, the pass is struck a little bit too hard. But good play there. Good defending from Team Bangladesh. Not taking any chances. They do enjoy the advantage of one goal, but that one goal can be easily equalized.
great opportunity for Team Nepal, but wasn't quite sure. Here's the replay. Couldn't really tell from that angle if that was a handball or not. We need to see from another angle. <laughs> but they're still protesting. The goalkeeper is down. Now, the last seven to 
six minutes of official time there. Still have ball possession. Team Nepal. Cross. And defended well there. Could have set up that play a little bit better. They had all, all the, all of his teammates right there. Another wasted opportunity. Less than six minutes of official time. Do subscribe to our channel for any upcoming, for new upcoming matches. Sportsworks. <coughs> and remember to hit that notification bell to get any new information <laughs> and updates of the SAF Under-16 Championship 2023. Team Nepal. Time to do a no pass. We'll keep it quickly passing it off to the right flank. Number 15. Last touch from Bangladesh. Throw in for Team Nepal. That's it in. The defender defends it well. Oh, oh, oh. some extra time, seconds, minutes. Team Nepal was the runners-up in 2022. They were defeated by India, who won the championship. And uh, Team Nepal also makes a Substitute number 12 is out and number 11 is in. Number 11 is Rohit Chestra. Gonna put in attacker. Deflected. <coughs> Bound dish. Well controlled there. Pass there by team Bangladesh. That is a tough tackle there. He might be given a yellow card. No. Quite lucky there. Quite lucky there for the defender from Team Nepal. It's gonna be just a free kick. It looked like it was a very tough tackle there. Tackle, but he kept his feet down. So now who did take the hunter sir? Free kick for Team Bangladesh. Two minutes of the official time. And quickly passes to the team captain. He beats his man. And that ball goes to <coughs> bounce. It might be, it's going to be a corner for Team Bangladesh. Last touch was by Team Nepal. Corners have always been a good situation for Team Bangladesh. Do have the advantage, slight 
advantage of the height. Here's the corner kick. First ball was uh, conceived due to a corner kick, just like this. <laughs> Nearly. Very close. Ball possession won by Team Bangladesh. Showing composure there is Team Nepal. That was the corner kick replay. Ooh, that curved really in. If there was no defender there, that would have gone straight in. Throw in for Team Nepal. There's another ball in the play, in the pitch. Long attempt. The seconds are dwindling down. Last me, they'll get about five minutes extra time. Six more minutes for Team Nepal to equalize. Another substitute from Team Nepal. Number 13 coming in for number 17. Darshan Adhikari. Team Nepal. Chances for Team Nepal are dwindling now. They still have about five minutes. And Bangladesh enjoying the majority of the ball possession. Especially in the latter end of the second half. And 
cross. Ooh, that was blocked. Paul not having any luck here. There's another go at it. The cross. That is a wide cross. He's just going to let that go out of bounds. These chances are going to be far and beyond. Now that the time is dwindling down, Bangladesh is going to waste as much time as possible. Let the seconds run down. Do remember to subscribe to our channel for any new updates and upcoming matches at SportsWix. by the defender. No chance. And the now they're going to waste as much time as possible. About 40 seconds left. Clearly, and the dish is going to take this win from Group A of the SAF Under-16 2023 Championship. And there goes the whistle. It is a win for Team Bangladesh. No, that is not the end of the whistle or the end of the match. Then. No, there was a foul on the play. I apologize. It appeared that it appeared to be a whistle, but there was a foul on the play, and this is a good, good opportunity for Team Nepal. This is a nerve-wracking moment in the very last seconds of the extra time. Nepal, can they convert? This is a really great opportunity. Do subscribe to our channel, Sportsworks, for upcoming matches. Team Nepal looks like the team captain, number seven, is going to take the attempt. No, he's not. Pass it off to the side. He attempts. Oh! Nearly goes in. He's clearly disappointed. And the referee blows the whistle. Which means Team Bangladesh is the clear winner with one goal. Team Bangladesh with that one goal. And they're celebrating. There's the replay. Number nine. Pass it off to the side. A good, good attempt. A good play. Just good. Target and team the ball. Just couldn't keep it down. That was a great opportunity. And there we go. You see the goalkeeper. And as soon as the whistle blows, the goalkeeper knows it. They've won the match. And the referees, the officials. <coughs> All the players are on the floor giving their best. Ladies and gentlemen. You have just watched the live coverage of SAF Under-16 Championship 2023 match between Nepal versus Bangladesh and Bangladesh with, wins it with 1-0. Thank you very much for watching the live coverage. Do subscribe to Sportsworks and keep yourself notified for any future upcoming games. Thank you very much. This has been a live coverage of Sportsworks and my name is Sangeet Chappelle and have a good night.